And here we go. We are going to, this time, instead of me showing you a replay, I'm going to show you a live attack using ballistas. Uh, I've got my iPad out now. Actually, not an iPad. I shouldn't. Come on now. Samsung. Working with the Koreans. Next, Nexus, here we go. Um, I'm going to use a very similar army to the other video that you might have seen. I, again, I'm taking the three ballistas, carry those three ballistas, don't let them die. 28 archers, two knights, one supply cart, one wall breaker, and two pikemen. Uh, really focusing again, if you get your ballistas out, you need your archers to support them. Slowly going around the outside of the walls is a good technique. Or, uh, potentially, if you can burst on catapults, do it. Um, I, again, I don't have all my spells here, so uh, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I think I actually do have all my spells. Uh, we'll see. I'm going to basically take whatever I get. I don't want to waste time with the video. So, um, again, I'm initially looking to see where the catapults are uh, when I'm using ballistas. Ooh, nice loot. Uh, it's too high level for me, though. I will not be able to handle this one. When farming, I mean, obvious things, I think, but uh, it's better to win and find. keep looking if you're not confident. Losses are bad. Um, if you have the time, look for a few different bases. Not an amazing amount of loot in this one, but I think I'm still going to go with it. I don't really want to wait around. Um, a nice safe spot up here to drop all my... Uh, catapults or uh sorry ballistas so look if you look up in this top area here you'll see that there's just a gap of no defenses at all ballistas with their range you can drop them in the nice like corner here surround them with archers as you can see um get them all out you're gonna see from the side here we have knights coming in that's why you got pikemen they're good against those knights uh get your supply card out and send your two knights in. Now you're kind of waiting to see how it all shakes out. Uh, at this stage, their garrison units start coming in. If your if your ballistas still look protected, you don't need to rally. Be patient on the rally. Uh, I got to get my wall breaker in there. It's not great. I'm getting um, my knights got killed, but I do have a templar I can send in, and I'm going to send my uh, extra units here. Now you can see the catapults being targeted already by the ballista and beautiful. Now that's huge. Now if I can get that second ballista with a nice little charge here, look at that. Two ballista, two catapults down. Now my actual ballistas are in a nice position here. They can reach a lot of buildings. They've still got a lot of archers protecting them. Um, they're gonna start crushing. Now you're going to see, I'm going to get into that town hall pretty soon. Um, this looks like a pretty decent one. So um, you can see now they're still protected in the middle. I might want to rally, um, but it looks like not a lot of uh, the garrison units are coming their way anyway. And they're all, oh, accidental rally there. We'll see how that goes. It actually placed them in a nice middle position if I can just hold off the garrisons. The damage that my ballistas will do from this position is huge, so... Getting your ballistas in range of as many buildings as possible is great. Um, and something you should be trying to do, but you can't lose your ballistas. So if you're going to push them forward, you got to be sure that they're protected. Um, if you burst and get crushed with your ballistas, it's a total waste. So, looks like this might be... Oh, another accidental uh, rally. Looks like I'm going to get a full uh, four star here. Not a five star. I didn't push for the town hall uh, or the town center. In a war strategy, you would have to do that. In farming, not really as important. Um, 33 seconds. Looks like I'm going to probably get the full four. Yeah, I will. I can use my last rally there or those archers will turn around. But there you go. That's just a farming attempt um oh that was dumb 
Uh, it doesn't matter though. Now, uh, you can see again, the key steps in this strategy, you are um, targeting catapults. Where are they? Um, you gotta make sure where they are first. Um, if you can kill one, great. Uh, you wanna drop your ballistas in a safe spot, surround them with archers, rally to protect ballistas whenever possible. And uh, you're always trying to catch those catapults whenever you can get them. As soon as you get the three catapults down at this uh, town center level in Gunpowder Age, you're going to uh, be in a much better ch position to get at least three stars, maybe four, and five if you've targeted the town center. Uh, all right, that's it for today. Uh, eventually, I'll get off of the ballista strategy, but um, I really do suggest it right now. Uh, there's lots of different strategies using more knights, more supply carts, but I think ballistas with their damage uh, capabilities are just a really good option to get those max five stars. If we want it, just like in COC, three star strategies in COC should be your goal. Five star strategies in uh, dominations need to be your goal. If you're not doing that, you're not going to win wars. So, uh, if anybody has any suggestions, throw them into uh, the comment box below. Uh, I'm willing to try out other armies. Maybe I'll give them a little practice and see how I feel with them. And uh, maybe if I feel good, I can throw another video up. Uh, right now, I'm just going to keep these ballista ones going until I discover something that I find works better. Thanks a lot.